Hello. How are you? Ah, the Brittany Hotel. Kamusta? How's everything? Oh, here we go. We're arriving. Hello. Oh, look at this entrance. Hello. How are you? Very good. I'm amazing. Never been better. I'm just checking in. And attach here is your, are your go vouchers. You can just press PH at the elevator. Okay, perfect. And it's uh, open from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. Okay. For your breakfast, it's located at the 8th level from 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. Uh, but, but the restaurants are open until 10 p.m. Perfect. Please enjoy um, your stay <laughs> So we don't have to worry about what you're going to eat. No, I can eat anything, especially okay. Filipino food. Oh, you love Filipino food. <laughs> Delicious. Thank you very much, Mike. Wow. They have, uh, even they have people opening the elevator for you. Okay, number 12. Boom. So, we're all checked in. This is one of the newer hotels, or newest hotels in all of Manila, and they've upgraded me to the suite. I'm so excited. Oh my god. 1209, 1209 Where is 1209? Where is it? Ah, it's there. 1209 Ooh, the sweet room. <laughs> oh, I don't believe it. I'm so lucky. I'm so, so lucky. All right. This is room one. Of course, we have a nice dinner area for me and my non-existent girlfriend, maybe. And there's the teas, the coffees over here. We have a little mini fridge with some waters, very nice. Yeah. Got lots of teas and coffees. A huge sofa with some really modern art. I think that's Picasso. And then they've given me a little treat in the room. Guys, you really didn't have to do this. Wow, this is amazing. We hope to brighten your day here, the Brittany Hotel. Oh no, look at this. <laughs> this looks crazy. I don't want to break it. I've already broken it. Okay, let's try a little bit. Mm. Oh yeah, that's so good. It's like cakes, custard cherries and profiteroles <laughs> well that's dinner sorted <laughs> no i'm joking now <laughs> i don't want to eat too much of that but we have a nice little box of fruits to counteract the dessert and then they've given us a nice welcome letter dear harry jaggard we really hope you have a bright day we're glad you chose Brittany to be your home we assure you to provide you service and comfort and you can ho get hold of your butler. I have a butler? By dialing 100. Oh dear. I have a butler. <laughs> we have a nice huge TV with just like lovely views of BGC, of the shopping malls, the apartment buildings, and the road. Very cool. So much light in here feel like this is like an apartment. I've got my own apartment. The next room is a little walk-in wardrobe because of course we, we needed one of those. And you've got your safe, you've got hangers. And then we have a big bathroom. Toilet here. We have two sinks with, uh, we've got also shower caps and shaving kits, dental kits and body lotions and you name it, everything. And then huge bath and a shower with a seat actually. So I might sit down and then again, some nice views. And of course a robe. And then finally, last but not least is the bedroom. We have a nice desk for me to work here. We have a chair for me to meditate. They've even given us I don't know, what animal is that? A bunny? A rabbit? With the big ears? Or maybe an elephant? <laughs> but very cool. I like the little touch. A nice king-size bed. Another TV and another place for me to sit. And more views of 
BGC, and then there's the American um, Memorial, I think it is, and this is a mini park actually, which I have been to before. Maybe we'll have another trip down um, and, and check out mini park, but it's a uh, very, very interesting views of Manila. And the sun is setting. So I've got you more, I've got to show you more of this hotel. This place is actually most well known for its food, uh, for its breakfast, for its dinner. So we're, of course we're gonna be showing you that. And they've also got a spa here, they've got a pool here. So there's so much more to show you guys. Now I've come up to the penthouse floor to check out the pool and look at this pool right here. We've got a nice little seating area here and then it's just infinity views over the Memorial Park here in BGC. If this isn't good views, then I don't know what is. And that sun is just looking beautiful. I'm gonna get right in because it's so hot today. I'm just dying. So let me just strip off and then we'll jump in. Look at the views of Manila. It really is like so developed around here. It's unbelievable. I feel like I'm in New York. All right, let's do some links. This has got to be one of the best views in Manila. I could be here all day just watching. And it's so quiet up here. You don't hear all the traffic. You can see the traffic, but you don't hear it. And I guess, I wonder what direction this is. I can't really see much out there, but the city wraps all the way around this building. And then this is BGC. We've got a nice memorial park here. Beautiful. I could get used to this. But unfortunately, we're only here for a few days. So I've been staying here for a few days now and I, I haven't actually realized that they've been coming in and cleaning the room without me knowing twice a day. And also another thing is they keep giving me extra treats in the room and they, I didn't realize. So they, they replaced this last night and I was like, oh, that looks a bit different like because I hadn't had much and then they replaced it again today. And they keep, I never finish. And they re replace it with new delicious treats. And I'm trying to not get fat, guys. And they keep giving me more fatty foods. Like, how am I supposed to eat all of that? But look at it, it looks so good. Oh my God, it's like brownie. Oh my God. Brownie, cherry, nuts. Every day I get new gifts, a new bowl of fruit. And I didn't actually realize they were doing it until now. Mm. I could have all that. So I'm hungry and I'm in my, in my room. So I thought I'll order some room service. And the room service here is quite unique. You can order it on your phone. So um, I just have to uh, ha go onto WhatsApp and then go on find the number of reception and I just order. So I've ordered salmon and pasta. It's the Western option, but I mean, the food here is like really nice. There's in continental options from like many places in the world as well as Filipino, but I've been here for a while now. So I've, I'm craving a little bit of Western food. So apologies, not Filipino today. Oh, hello. Oh, wow. You're bringing the whole dinner table in. <laughs> yes, yeah, come in, come in. <laughs> oh, he has it in a little tray down there. Sure. Ah, a little secret compartment. <laughs> and there we go. Wow, look at that. Thank you, sir. Amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you, Thank you Ronald. <laughs> it's like a little magic trick. Oh, wow. Wow. I might be able to fit myself in there. Okay, I'm going to eat it very unprofessionally on the sofa. Because why not? I'm in my own room. I can do what I want. So. We've got the salmon, it's a huge bit of salmon, and then this is like uh, soy pasta. Thought I'd go for that, why not? It smells incredible, and like the presentation, it's like I'm in some kind of very fancy restaurant. So the food here has been definitely a cut above every other hotel. Usually like, even five star hotels like this, the food is, is great, but this is like, the room service is like, restaurant really nice restaurant food so yeah but does it taste though that's good mm. oh my god i 
That is exactly what I wanted. The salmon is cooked perfectly. Look at this, it's so oily and soy, soy sauce. Almost like sweet pasta. It's delicious. That was bloody amazing. Oh, I would have that 10 times in a row. The food here has just been outstanding. Good evening, how are you? Good? I've come for, I've come for some delicious cocktails. Yeah. I've heard you are the master cocktail maker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Going to help you. Okay, perfect. Do you have a menu? Yes, yes sir. Okay. Oh wow, you got a lot of drinks here. Ooh. Bit of red wine, bit of liquor, bit of beer. No red horse? <laughs> no, I'm joking. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. Uh, Did you try the Pil Pilsen? It's uh, what's the original. The, what's the name? Uh, Pil Pilsen. It's Pil a Pilsen. Filipino beer. No, no. Uh, Filipino beer. Filipino beer? Yeah. Okay. Could I have a, yes, a margarita? Margarita? Yeah, yeah. So this is like a little bar they have. It's not super busy right now, but I can imagine this is a great place to have a little party. Oh, this no way. Uh, oh, San Miguel. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know this one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll just have the margarita, but that's cool. What's your favorite drink? This one, rum. Oh, your favorite drink is rum? Yeah. Nice. This one, oh, uh, try nice. this one. It's a Filipino Oh, nice. Also. This is a Filipino beer? Yeah. Uh, rum, ah, sorry? Rum. Oh, sweet. I like the design. Yeah. Taste uh, sweet. Nice. Better than Tandoi? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but this one is better. Okay. It's good. Nice. I'm in the hotel for three days. Three days? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I moved, somewhere, I moved to Pasai and then I'm going home. I haven't been home in six months. Oh. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Yeah. I'm always, always interested in how they make the cocktail and my favorite cocktail is margarita so you gotta have a margarita Can I film you making it? Sure Can I film you making it? Sure Yeah? Hey, what's your videos in uh, Bangladesh? Oh yeah? yeah. <laughs> Thank you brother Oh on Facebook? Yeah on Facebook. Oh Facebook yeah yeah, yeah. Nice uh, The street foods of the Bangladesh are mm -hmm. good or? Uh, not all of it, but it's good, yeah. Like the curry is good, the chicken is good. Bangladesh is the uh, same as Indian food? Yeah, 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 very similar to Indian food, yeah. Yeah. But no pork, because no they, they are Muslim. Yeah. Chicken and fish. Yeah, a lot of chicken and fish, yeah. Not so busy today. No. no? It's done. <laughs> so, first of all, you gotta dip the glass in the salt yeah. to get the rim salt all around. I always find it interesting how uh, how there's always salt on the edge. Makes it really interesting flavor. This is a basic margarita. Mm -hmm. Classic. Nice. Look at that. Got loads of salt around the edge. What's the what's the What's the spirit? Uh, it's a tequila, sick verbo. Ah, uh, nice. Is Filipino? Ah, uh, no, sir. No. It's uh, from Brazil. Brazil? Oh, yeah. wow. I'll be saying abrigado after this. That was a bad joke. And then this one's Contru. What's the name? Contru. Contru. It's also tequila? No. What is it? It's a uh, liquor. Oh, okay. Nice. <laughs> I didn't actually know the ingredients of a, of a margarita until now, so yeah. I'm finding out. And then the fresh le uh, lemon. Oh, nice. So did you go to bartender school? Yeah. Oh, nice. Is it quite, quite, uh, quite long, quite hard, or is it easy? Yes, yeah, hard. Hard. You need to study. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Can you do tricks? No. <laughs> <laughs> I can do tricks when I've had a few beers. Yeah, that tricks is so hard. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Here we go. Nearly ready. The famous shake. Yeah. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, perfect. This looks like a delicious margarita. Now uh, the whole cup is very cold. Oh yeah, salamat, salamat kuya. Thank you. You're from Manila? Uh, no, sorry, like, from Laguna. Laguna, where's that? Uh, San Pedro. Where's San Pedro? Uh, it's a part of Manila. Ah, oh, okay. We, uh, Further out. Yeah. Nice. Well, thank you very much. Sure. Cheers. Cheers. Give it a taste. Enjoy. Thank you very much. Look at that. Oh yeah, delicious. Master up. It's uh, it's very good. It's like a, I don't know. I'm not really a big alcohol drinker, but <laughs> I know a, I know a good margarita when I when I taste one. Mm. Now I'm going to show you guys what breakfast here in this hotel is like. Let's go there and check it out. So it's actually on the 8th floor. Um, so I've never been here, but this is very nice. I come quite early, so it's a bit quiet. You've got a nice bar here. Good morning. Number. Magandang Umaga. Number, sir. Magandang yes. Umaga, sir. Yeah. Uh, your room number, sir. Oh. 1209. That's it. Yeah. You got it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Thank you very much. Where do you want to sit, sir? Is uh, it a window or near the buffet? Uh, window's fine. Yeah, yeah. Okay, sir. This way, sir. Perfect. Wow. Oh, nice. This is a, looks a pretty nice buffet. How about this table, sir? Perfect. Thank you so much. What was your name? Ser Serio. Serio. Nice to meet you. Enjoy your breakfast. Okay, sir. thanks very much. Okay, let's have a look. Oh, we got the open kitchen. Let's have a little look. So we got the garlic rice, of course. We got the pancit puti. Never had that. Guinea sang sayote, never had that. Sauteed chicken and peanut, of course I've had that. Dying and bangus, it's just fish. Pork hamondo, wow. It's just some really unique dishes I've never seen before in like buffets before. And we've got a bit of oriental, dim sum, shao pao. Nice, nice little, uh, ooh, a little shot to wake us up. And then cereal, and then of course the the Western options. I'm probably going to be hanging around this area because this is my favorite. Hash browns, pancakes, lots of bacon, and then of course the bread. And of course the ube bread. All right, let's get a selection. And we might get some eggs as well, get a selection. And then we'll, uh, we'll eat up. Oh, I forgot to show you. Also, we have over here, the egg and omelet station. Ooh. Hello. Magandang umaga. Magandang umaga. Ah, Kamo sta ka? Mabuti? Can I get um could I get three fried eggs? Three fried eggs. Yeah. Thank you. Um, that's all. That's all. And then fruit and then Oh, they have iced coffee. Wow. This is it's the little things that count. I never see iced coffee at a buffet before. So this is perfect. Cucumber lemonade and some infused water. Perfect. Okay, so I got a mix of Filipino dishes, Chinese and Western, and then we also got some lovely dessert <laughs> for breakfast. Why not? I'm on holiday. Start off with the shot and the drink. Hopefully there's no vodka in here. Oh wow, that tastes incredible. Oh, thank you very much. Salamat po. Just enjoy some. And to top it off, three fried eggs, get your protein in. So I'm going to go for the Filipino dishes, of course. I'm very intrigued to try this pork because it's got like a, it's got like a sweet sauce. Mmm. That's gotta be some of the best pork I've ever had. It's like the, the sauce they've put on it. It's like a sticky 
tangy sauce. Mm. Oh my god. Next up is the chicken with like uh, nuts and stir fried vegetables. It's also delicious. Fried. Look at like pepper. Also like I think it's cashew nuts, maybe? Or peanuts. Really nice. Next up of course, chow pao. We'll peel this off. I wonder what's inside. Mm, chicken. So good. And finally, the nut pudding. Who would have thought for breakfast? We gotta go for it. Let's see what's inside. Oh, so it's just like gooey on the middle, and then on the top it's got like a crunchy base. Mmm. Oh my god. That's just like a very powerful taste of peanut butter and crunchy. So good. And there we go guys, this is the end of my stay here at this hotel. Brittany Hotel has been an absolutely incredible stay. The service here is like probably the best I've had in a long time and the food was the, the best food I've ever had in a hotel before. So yeah, hands down, great experience. Also, I just love BGC. I think I want to move here. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.